Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello everyone. Welcome back to our channel. My name is Kani Handayani and in this video I would like to explain about types of the text. Actually there are 14 types of the text, but in this video I will continue the explanation before about types of the text. And in this video I would like to explain three types of the text by comparison the fun social function and the genetic structure and the language feature that it's used in this text. Okay, let's start. To the first is an analytic exposition. An analytic exposition is a type of spoken or written that elaborates the writer's idea about the phenomena surrounding. The social function of the text is intent to persuade the listener or readers that something is the case. To make the persuasion stronger, the speaker or writer gives some arguments as the fundamental reason why something is the case. So the generic structure of analytic exposition, there are three, namely, first, thesis in introduction, that introduction, the topic, and indicating the writer position. And the second is argument in the body, that explaining the argument to support the writer position. And the last is reiteration in the conclusion, restarting the writer's opinion. To more understand about the type, here is the analysis example of analytic exposition and the language feature that is used in the text. Analytic exposition, the significant grammatical features that is used is focused on generic human or non-human participants. You can see in the red color, and use of simple present tense, and use of relational process, you can see in the orange color, and use of internal conjunction to stage the argument, you can see in the green color, and the last is reasoning through casual conjunction, or normalization. You can see in the underlying phrase in the text. Okay, next to the second types, that is explanation text. Explanation text is a text which starts processing relating to forming of natural, social, scientific, and cultural phenomena. Explanation text is to say why and how of the forming of the phenomena. It is often found in sketchy, geography, and historic textbook. The social function of explanation text. Explanation is a text which tells process relating to forming of natural, social, scientific, and cultural phenomena, and to explain how or why something happens. The generic structure of explanation, that is, that is general statement, in the general statement starting the phenomena issues which are to be explained and sequence of explanation that stating a series of steps which explain the phenomena of the source. To more understand about the types, here's the analysis example of explanation text about natural phenomena and the language feature that is used in the text. The explanation text the significant grammatical features that is used is focus on generic non-human participant. You can see in the red color and use mainly of material and relational process. You can see in the green color and use mainly of temporal and casual curcumatis and conjunction. You can see in the underlying word and of the text and use of simple present tense we can see in the text and some use of passive voice to get them right for example in the orange color okay let's do the last is discussion text discussion text is a text which present a problematic discourse this problem will be discussed from different viewpoints Discussion is commonly found in philosophical, historic, and social texts. In other words, discussion is kind of genre used to present at least two points of view about an issue. 
So the social function of discussion text is to present two points of view about issue or problem and to present arguments from different points of view about issue or problem. The generic structure of discussion text is issue, stating the issue which is to discuss, argumented pro, presenting the point in supporting the present issue, argument con, presenting other points which disagree to the supporting point, and conclusion or recommendation, stating the writer recommendation. To more understand about the type, here's the analysis example of discussion text and the language feature that is used in the text. In discussion text, the significant grammatical features that is used is introducing category or generic participant, focus on generic human and generic non-human participant, you can see in the right color, and using thinking verb, you can see in the purple color in the text, and using contrastive conjunction in the text, however, and using modalities that is shown in the text, you can see in the blue color, and using adverbial of manner, you can see in the pink color of the text and using simple present. I think that's all for me about three types of text that is an analytic exposition, explanation text, and discussion text. Hope you understand that material that I have explained. So thank you for watching this video. The last essay, wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.